Hi, I'm Lucas Demo, producer of Dungeon Drafters, a dungeon crawler card game where you play as a young adventurer eager to explore ancient ruins and collect new cards. And as you can see, I just found myself in a combat room. Well, hopefully I'll be able to finish this encounter, judging by the cards that I have in hand. First, I can see that I have Echo Slam. This card deals increasingly more damage in area based on the number of enemies hit, and it is quite a useful card. This already makes me think about Fishing Hook, another card that I have in hand. It deals damage to the first enemy hit, but more importantly, it pulls the enemy closer to me. Now I'm able to combo off Echo Slam and do a huge amount of damage, finishing most of the enemies in the battle. After spending my 3 action points, it is time for enemies to play, or actually the enemy since there's only one left. This guy is a simple bruiser, but is smart enough to heal himself after almost getting killed. Here I decided just to walk and melee attack. The goblin will hit me for a few health points, but this alone does not represent a real threat anymore. Once the battle has ended, I can now freely explore the dungeon back again, and of course, collect my rewards. Dungeons, they contain a lot of different elements. At the end of each floor, you can heal yourself back to full life and reshuffle your cards. But you also must choose between diving even further into the dungeon and risking all of your cards, or safely returning to the adventure's town. This is where another whole section of the game takes part. Here is where you can buy cards, you can open boosters, you can talk to NPCs, explore the town, complete quests, edit your deck, and inspect and explore your card collection. Deck building is super important in Dungeon Drafters. The game offers you an infinite number of creative tools to shape your deck. Some of you might enjoy crafting the weirdest of combos, and some others will love to min-max and find the most efficient deck. And that's just to start with. You can play with six different characters, each with their unique playstyle. You may venture in one of the six dungeons at any moment, fight epic boss battles or simply... well, simply enjoy the fishing minigame. And that's all, thank you very much for watching.